Another cool command in Windows, we're going to go to the Start menu here. We're going to type in SPE. And it says Windows Speech Recognition. Believe it or not, this is included with this version of Windows. And it's basically a wizard that if you have a microphone connected to your PC, you can control your PC by talking to it. So uh, we're not going to go over this in any great detail, but you just click next. It'll ask us some questions. So we have a uh, another microphone. This right now wants to use the microphone in our webcam. Actually, I think we have to use the microphone in the webcam because uh, we're recording this video with our other microphone. You can't use, you need to have two microphones. So basically, you'll walk your way through this. And now we can talk and it's uh, recording. Peter dictates to his computer. He prefers typing and particularly prefers it to pen and paper. Then we click next. The microphone is ready to use with the computer. Uh, privacy statement, enable a document review or disable it. We'll enable it. You can decide what you want to do. Manual activation, or we can use the voice to activate. So we could say, in this case, it's stop listening. You're giving it commands to do certain things. We'll stick with manual. There's also a reference card, so we can view it or we can print this out. So here are some of the commands. Set up speech recognition. Using speech recognition. So it, we can walk our way through some of the controls here. So uh, let's see. Select any item by saying its name. File, edit, view, save. Select any item. Click, file. Click, bold. Click, save. Etc. Etc gives you some commands, so I would uh, encourage you to print this out if you want to use the speech recognition. And then we can go next here. We can run speech recognition at startup. I'm not going to have that on all the time. And uh, that's pretty much it. We can run the tutorial. I, I would recommend that you start the tutorial because that's going to walk you through um, using the commands also too as the computer the more you talk into the computer the more the computer understands your voice so it may be a little frustrating at first but once you use it for a couple of days or so and say a lot of things to it it'll understand your voice better I'm gonna just kill this right now after you do the wizard the speech recognition will put a little icon up here at the top, and this is because we set it to be manual. So I'll have to turn it on and turn it off when I want to use it. I can also exit it, and then we can run it again some other time. But if I turn it on right now, Open Internet Explorer. Open Excel. Open Word. This is cool. I think everyone will enjoy talking on their computer. New line. I can't think of anything to say right now. I wish I had a book handy that I could dictate. Period. New line. As you can see, not everything works perfectly, but it's pretty darn good for free. So, but anyways, you can keep going through this or you can come and correct changes. There's probably a way to, to correct the changes in the manual. Okay.